Hi guys, if you're unable to launch PUBG on your Windows computer, then not to worry, as in this guide I'll be showing you some quick and simple steps that you can take to solve this issue. Now, I won't waste your time, so I'll jump straight into it, and the first thing we need to do is head over to our Steam application, and from the top here, just come inside of Library, and we need to find PUBG Battlegrounds from our list of games on the left here, and we're going to right click, come over to Properties, and then head inside of the Installed Files from the left here, and we're just going to press this Verify Integrity of Game Files button, and this is just going to check that none of our files are either damaged or broken or corrupt so just give this a few seconds to complete and wait for this to get to 100% and if any problems are found it will repair these files inside of here then we can close out of this window and the next thing you're going to do is head over to steam in the top left hand side here come over to settings and then head inside of this downloads tab from the left come down to clear download cache and we're going to press this clear cache button and we can go ahead and press confirm. Now this is going to restart the Steam application and may require you to log back in. So once you've logged back in, then just head back over to library, come back over to PUBG from the left here, and we're going to right click again and come inside of manage, select browse local files, and then come inside of TSL game, inside of binaries, win64, and inside of this folder you should see a file called tslgame.exe, and we're simply going to right click on this file, come over to properties, head over to the compatibility tab, and ensure that disable full screen optimizations is checked here, and also check this box next to run this program as administrator and then press apply and ok to save your changes and then we can try double clicking on the game from here to see if that's now fixed the launching issue. So if that's still not working the next thing you need to do is head over to your start menu and we're going to search for Windows Defender and then just come over to the Windows Defender firewall here, select allow an Apple feature through Windows Defender firewall on the left and then just go ahead and press this change settings button at the top here and we need to ensure that PUBG is added into this list down here. Now if you can find PUBG PUBG Battlegrounds in this list, then simply come over to it and make sure private and public are both ticked in these boxes. If you don't have PUBG inside of this list, then you'll simply need to add the application by selecting allow another app, coming over to browse, and then you'll just need to locate the PUBG Battleground executable file. Once we've ensured that private and public are both checked in here, we can close out of the firewall settings, and we're going to come over to our start menu and search for settings, and then come over to the settings tab. Scroll all the way down here to Windows Update, and then just press this check for update button, and we're just going to ensure that our computer is running the latest version of Windows, as sometimes if you are running outdated version of Windows, this can cause compatibility issues with our other applications and games. So once you've ensured you're fully up to date here, we can then come out of the settings window, and we're going to next come over to the start menu and search for task manager, and then come over to the task manager tab. Now inside of the task manager window, we're just going to close down any background applications that we're not currently using and could be causing conflicting issues with our game. So you'll simply need to right click on anything you're not using, and then just press on end task and just make sure you know what the process is before ending the task just to ensure you don't close down anything that actually is quite important for our computer and once you've closed down all the background applications we can close out of this window and once again you can check to see if that's fixed the issue now if that's still not working the very last thing that we can do that will be sure to fix this issue is come back over to the steam application head back over to library and find pubg from this list of games and we're going to right click again and come into properties and inside of here you'll see this launch options section now all we need to do is type in here the minus sign followed by dx11 and this is going to launch up the game using the direct x11 version so we can close out of here and we can try right clicking on pubg and selecting play and that should have now fixed any launching issues you were experiencing now if this video did help you then please consider dropping a like and subscribing until next time